The way the Barron County Sheriff's Office handles information just got a big overhaul. WBKO's Zach Gamlin shows us how the new Digital Command Center helps the deputies help you. Long gone are the days of leaving information on post-it notes, hard copies of paper, and dry erase boards in the workplace. We were able to purchase this uh, as a tool to help everyone within the department. The almost obsolete forms of communication have been replaced by email, text messages, and now the Digital Command Center. It's the Sheriff's Office's way of communicating with each other while keeping you safe. Here and there with the shuffle, you know, the paper may get lost or they may not see the note hanging there. Uh, this is one centralized location. Trevor Phillips with the Sheriff's Office says it's a pretty simple concept. You just log into a website to change notes, alerts, and phone calls officers need to follow up on. We can uh, add extra patrols, um, important dates or announcements, uh, even maybe uh, recovered stolen property. The Sheriff's Office received a grant to pay for the nearly $5,000 upgrade and the money spent stays here locally. The Digital Command Center was designed by ETA Media in Glasgow. We can connect to any of the, any of the digital signs that we have anywhere in the world from any device. Company CEO Jeremy Jacobs says the Sheriff's Office is the first organization to use his digital media platform in this way and he hopes it catches on. What we were able to do for them was create a digital version of a dry erase board. Uh, this information can be updated in real time so these officers are able to share that information instantly. Phillips says while he's excited this new equipment will help eliminate clutter in his office, he's most looking forward to the end result, helping the people of Barron County. In Glasgow, Zach Gammon, WBKO. The Digital Command Center has been up and running for about two weeks. Phillips says it's already helped the response time for deputies.